Hey everybody, I'm Jeff, and today I'm going to show you how to create a Microsoft Word document with both a header and with columns. A header can help you get your title across very clearly right at the beginning, and then columns can help break down your, the body of your text into a pretty aesthetically pleasing way. So let's check it out. Now, first of all, you're going to, even though if it was up to me, I would, I would have put header under insert because you're going to insert it, but Technically, it's already there, and so you're just going to click on View and view the spot for the header. This is my header. And there it is. You have a header. And if you, uh, if you go down another page and you insert a section break, that will be your header on every page. And so now you want some columns to go with that. You're going to go into Format columns and you're going to format your document to have more than one column because technically the default is to have one column and that's what you're working with through the whole page and so you can split that up into two and then you can see a preview there you can see three columns and this will not uh, affect your header your header will be one solid header across the top so let's do three columns and you hit OK and we'll test it out column one Column two. And you go all the way down. It's essentially like a, a page break, but not really. So you hit enter a million times just to test it. Now if you were typing, you'd go all the way down, and then when you're done typing, it would end up up here, and then so column three. And so we have three columns and we have a header on the same document. It's like magic. And that's how you create a Microsoft Word document with both a header and columns. I'm Jeff, and thank you for watching.